Hey guys, Tommy Danger here, TR Motorsports, um, doing a brake job on the M4, uh, which is right there, and put some brake rotors on, and it is just magical to see these ginormous rotors and those silly, silly thick pads that are 22 millimeters. It's, it's just obnoxious how great they are. So anyways, I uh, wanted to share another great part uh, with you guys, if you have a car that is a track car, like Steve's car here, um, you might want to check sometimes behind the little plastic pieces that are um, your fender liners and all that kind of jazz, because you'd be surprised how much extra weight you're carrying around. And here's how it looks. So we zoom in on this rascal here, and then we come around and we have the fender liners cut back because the tires would be just rubbing them through anyways. So when they're cut back, this is the great part, what's behind it? So let me see if I can hold the light and everything at the same time. Put my finger in there, check this out. Extra weight, yes indeed. Look at that. That's all extra, extra, extra rubber that you've been carrying around for just no whole reason. But uh, we clean this out once in a while. And uh, this is after, I don't know, probably five or six events. Look at that, look at that stuff. Look at how much stuff is coming out of here. This is crazy. Dig all that rubber out, I mean, look at it. It's just like, Marble on top of marble on top of marble. It's cool, but sad that all those tires have been shredded to little bits and pieces so that they can be embedded inside of fender liners. <laughs> that is crazy. So this is a brake pad box. So you can compare to how much stuff are we talking about in one wheel well. That's a lot. So, check your fender liners and clean out all your excess places. Tommy, out.